Esprit TV Wireless What's up? It's Georgia backstage at Wireless Festival for SBTV with some of the famous Detroit Dirty Dozen. Hello. Yeah, Woo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We in here. We in the house. We in the house again. Yeah. Low end, doing, doing it once again. Yeah. Do you want to uh, introduce yourselves? Yo, this is Swifty McVeigh, that D12 representer. That's right, man. Caniva, D12 all day, baby. What's up? What's up, Bizarre, man? What's up? Uh, now, you guys have had a huge career. It spanned, like, more years than I can even count. What has been your highlight so far? Uh, I'll never forget the highlight of my career is always shooting the first video. It was shooting our first video in Detroit, and that was pretty much like one of my dreams, that little thing right there, just riding through the city of Detroit shooting the video. And, and, and I had the pleasure of actually riding past his house while we was doing it. I know that felt real good to yeah. absorb that moment. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but would you agree with these guys? Yeah, it was pretty cool, you know what I'm saying, doing the first video in Detroit, representing Detroit. Yeah. And um, how, how have your videos moved on since then? Um, you say, how have they been? How, how have they moved on since your very first one? Um, well, we, we switch it up differently on it. Yeah, a, little, a, lot, a lot more yeah. expensive, but um, depends on the subject matter of the uh, song. But, you know, we like to just keep our videos different and stuff. You know, we, we do a lot of different, like you see how fi fight music is gritty, then we come back with, I mean, well, Purple Pills was colorful, then fight music gritty. You know, we switch it up all the time, so uh, we just like keeping them versatile. Now, I uh, don't want to bring you down, but what's been uh, the worst point of your career in, in the last few years? Well, you know, with the, with the loss of Bucks, our first, um, first group member that we lost, and also with Proof. So those, those both are the two of the main low points of the career, both, both times, you know. So that's been, uh, you know, a struggle in itself. But, you know, we're going to keep on and doing, it, doing what we do in the name of those two guys. And um, how, how do you think, other than obviously losing some people, how do you think your, your group has evolved since you guys started out? Uh, just been, uh, you know, uh, more uh, business mind and, uh, you know what I'm saying, just getting things together and, uh, you know, trying to do this mainly for proof and uh, being more, more, you know, business cats and uh, doing solo projects and putting this D12 music out for everybody. Yeah, more business minded, uh, you know, putting putting more much more energy into the music and concentrating on the things around us much more than we used to, you know, uh, and um, getting a little bit more on the serious side. The 12 is known for cracking jokes and smiling and whatever, but uh, you're going to see a lot of seriousness from us too, you know, and that's what's up. And, and you guys have been busy? I heard you've been working on your new album. Yeah, I got a new album, uh, Friday Night at St. Andrews. Yeah. Uh, Hot too. It's hot. Hot, hot to death. Smoke it. Smoke it. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, that's it. And uh, what can we expect from that? Oh, uh, man, uh, much more serious, uh, bizarre on there, you know what I'm saying? Kind of giving you a list of a little warm-up uh, D12 album, uh, you know, you know, talking about our life and the kind of stuff that we've been through in the last four and a half, five years. And uh, what are you guys up to now? You got a busy summer? Oh, yeah, yeah. We got, uh, you know, the festivals going on, uh, a lot of other shows is going on and working on music, so it's going to be pretty busy. But we're ready for it, though. It's, it's time for D12 to uh, get back in the forefront and do what we do. You know, I know people have been missing us. Have you missed us? I missed you. Yeah. I was like, where are you? Yeah, you know, so we're coming back, and um, coming back stronger than ever. And just thank the fans out there for supporting D12 and, and being behind us 100%, and we're coming back. And uh, how, how are you feeling about the show? Oh, man, there's a lot of high energy going on in here, man. So, I mean, tomorrow, as soon as we stepped up in here, my eyeballs was like this. Yeah. Really? <laughs> Those are some eyeballs. <laughs> exactly. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be fun, man. I mean, every time we come here, high energy. No, no matter when we come over here, it gets bigger and bigger and bigger, man. So I'm, I'm, I'm excited, and I'm looking forward to hitting that stage. Oh, yeah? Yeah, for sure. Well, I'll leave you to get ready, guys. Thank you so much. I'm looking forward to it. All right. Thank you. Thank you.